Hello everyone, my name is Alex, also known as AdPan503. Anyway, today I have a little gameplay for you on Interchange. We're playing some Domination Ground War. And today I am going to talk about spawn trapping. And for once, I don't know what happened here. I think I got killed while I'm using my Predator. I don't really know. But anyway, who cares? Um, spawn trapping, as you can see, my team or my yeah my clan uh, we have the flag C and B and now they're spawning by A but um before I get into that let me tell you what I'm using today I'm using the ACR one of my most favorite weapons of all time um, I um, I have the two attachments with the silencer and smaller aka suppressor as well as extended mags um, I'm using stun grenades and stem techs and I'm not using specialist today, which is a shocker, isn't it? Not really. Um, for those of you who know, I love specialist. Uh, most people do. Uh, uh, my perks, I am using sleight of hand, hard line, and I believe steady aim. Yeah, it, mu it must be steady aim. But I'm also using the Predator, Reaper, and AC-130. Now let's go back to the topic of the video. Spawn trapping. As you can see, like I said before, we still have the C and B flags back behind me, and they are all spawning by the A flag. Now, I uh, one of my teammates is right here where I am right now, or should have been, and uh, another teammate is usually covering that tunnel, and another one on the right-hand side straight in front of me to the left. And if you don't push him too far, you can trap him there. No, keep spawning by A, just... But if you push in a little too far, they will spawn on the opposite side of the map, which is C flag for us. Since so once we know C, we usually have someone stand there. But honestly, when me and my friends don't or teammates, when we play Call of Duty, we kind of try to spawn jet, but we also love rushing. We no one just likes standing still. And this one, don't get me wrong, it's a decent gameplay, but it's not the most entertaining or the best scored or the best game, uh, in general um i just put it up because it gets to the point um as you can see on the uav it's just, just spawning right in front of me over there um it's a little unfair but it's if you can do it well you can do it well um one on this one is a very easy map to spawn trap them in as well as mish mission yeah mission it's Missions too ridiculous. Um, they need to fix that actually, like right now. I <laughs> was gonna pull up my reaper and was like, no, nah, that's a bad spot. Let's go right here. This is, by the way, one of the most campish spots ever. Um, whenever you're going around that corner, always check that spot. Um, one out of three times, I always find someone there. Um, I fast forward the reaper here. It's not that great of a reaper. And I missed a lot because I tried to shoot down that recon drone. But anyway. Now, wouldn't that be cool? I was just thinking about when I was using that Reaper. Uh, what if I can shoot down that really tiny recon drone? Anyway, um, what else to talk about? Spawn trapping. Anyway, uh, I believe I'm playing with a almost full party here. Um, I think one of our randoms goes way too far into their spawn, so he flips them, which that means that they'll spawn on the opposite end. Um, Look at this guy. What are you doing on the ground? Right there. Anyway, here's a nice multi kill. Oh, oh, oh. And four man kill. Get the Reaper. Anyway, guys, um, my question to you all today would be what's your favorite kill streak and why? Um, I have multiple classes that are pretty much the exact same, except for uh, little tweaks here and there, and also different strike packages. Like, let's say. For my ACR classes, I have three ACR classes. Uh, one is my strike, uh, assault strike package one. One is my other assault strike package one. So I have two different assault, well, two different assault striker or strike packaged um, ACR classes, and then I have a specialist class. Oh man, they just can't get out of this, can they? Oh, I kind of feel bad about this. It sucks. It sucks when you get trapped like this, but. Honestly, I believe these guys didn't know how to get out of this. <laughs> um, it is fairly difficult to get out of spawn trap, and when you play solo, by for example, and then you're all of a sudden, yes, let's go, let's get, let's play some Call of Duty, and then you spawn in, you usually get dropped into a 
Oh, here I go. Here I go. The game's almost over, and I'm just like, fuck it. Let's go and charge in. Play how I usually play. And if only I had reloaded earlier. Oh, that would have been a nice triple feed. Get the last guy with the pred. Why not? The douche who killed me. <laughs> um, so, yeah. Anyway, game's almost over here. Uh, yeah, so what are your favorite strike packages? What do you use? Why do you use it? Um, like I was saying earlier, though, I have one with... This is my first ACR class. Um, and I have another one with the uh, AH6 Overwatch and Pavlo instead of the Reaper AC-130 because I kind of like um, to run around a lot in the smaller, close quarter maps. Then I mainly run my specialist one. So uh, leave a comment telling me what you guys think about uh, what your favorite strike packages is. And there's my mo homie money stacks. Props to you. It's already at level 10. That's ridiculous, isn't it, guys? Well, the final score is 47 and 7. Hope you enjoyed. Check out my last video, which is in the bottom right there. And also, you know, if you could rate and then give me a comment. Tell me what you guys think about um, my videos, what I'm doing, what you guys want to see next. And also talk about those strike packages. And subscribe if you like my content, guys. I'm out. And peace.